All right, welcome back. It's Tragic Life. Um, here with Final Fantasy V. Last video, we got three of the twelve legendary weapons. Um, not much happened in that. We traveled there. We did that. Um, so we have the Excalibur, the Masa Moon, and I think the Holy Lance. Yes. Um, so we're going to go ahead and grab two items in this game. Um, I'm not exactly sure where they are. Um, so we got to fly to more. Um, the City of Moor. Um, one of the best spells in the entire game, Haystega, is there. Haystega is very, very powerful because it casts haste on the entire party instead of having to cast one at a time, which makes your character faster. So I'm going to go ahead and pause this video. Um, and while I pause this video, go ahead and hit that like button, that subscribe button, and leave me a comment. I will be right back. That's one of the two things. That's, yeah, that's one of the two things. Uh, we'll go get that one. Be right back. All right, we're back. I wanted to show you where it is. So we're here, right? So you're going to come all the way down. And it's right here. So finding a spot to land might be a little bit pain in the butt. Oh, are you serious? Do I really got to go that far? Oh, that's going to be fun. Let's see. Oh. So we got to cross the desert. All right, no worries. Can I cross it? Are you going to let me? Oh, we got to cross the forest, everything. Okay, well, that's cool, I guess. It'll be worth it. It's a long trek, though. Okay, so we have some bullets. Two of our, three of our characters hit really hard, which is gonna make. Good God! Did you just body slam my thing? Come on, don't body slam my black mage. All right. Okay, so we're going to go up here. So that was an Elm Gigas, a Shadow whatever that was, and a Python. Something we fought in a couple levels back. We got cover. Yay, crowd gain, black level 5. Cool, cool, cool. So we'll come this way. All right, and now we're in more. So in more, we want to go to the magic shop, Charlie. All right, so one of them is going to have it. Let's see. You. Oh. Right there it is. We already have it. <laughs> Ain't that funny. Anyway, so that you definitely want that. And eventually we're going to go ahead and we're going to use that a lot. Um, we're not quite there yet, but that's fine. Um, next up is Big Guard. We want Big Guard. Um, it's a little bit harder to get, or not harder, but a little more time consuming. We have to go into the ocean and wait until we get into a fight with the Stingray. Uh, we got some new bad guys. We got a Mykow, Gloom Widow, and a Slug. As you can see, three of my characters hit really, really hard. Critical attack. Yeah, that's a pretty decent attack. But you're probably gone. Yeah, that's what I figured. Alright, so we'll walk all the way back. Um, I'll actually meet you on the ocean. Um, so well, anyway, we got to get into a sting fight with a stingray, and then we have to cast Reflect on it, right? Um, and then we have to wait for it to use Big Guard, which means we need a blue mage. So yeah, um, I'll meet you on there when we're in position to do it, and when we get a stingray, so that you guys can see me get the great guard, a big guard. So until then, uh, I know I'm cutting this video up a little bit, but that's all right. See you guys in a second. All right, so let me go ahead and say it took me a long time to, to get to this fight. 
And part of the reason why is because I was looking for a stingray. This is the stingray. Okay, so I made a couple changes. Um, so I'll show you how we do this. Uh, we can go ahead and try to kill one of them off. These guys are not that strong. Um, but what we're going to do... So this one's going to die. And we're going to cast... On this one. Okay. Oh, so you could do that too? Sheesh. And we're going to hit him hard. Hopefully we don't kill him. And now we're just going to defend. Alright. And then eventually he'll cast great... So what Big Guard does is it cast Protect Shell Float on the entire party, which is awesome. So from this point on, once you get it, which it's, it might take me a while, I might actually go off camera again because otherwise you're going to sit here and wait for this to happen. Um... <clears throat> So for every boss fight, we're going to cast both the Haystega and the Big Guard. Because it'll give us a big boost. So um, I'm going to go and pause it again until we go ahead and until I get him to do it. So I'll be right back. Alright, so I was wrong. This is actually the Stingray. <clears throat> He's actually <coughs> terrible. I'm hoping that he dies soon. I, I've almost hit him with 10,000 life. Um... He's very hard to hit with anything, <clears throat> and he takes forever to cast Great Guard, but I, he did cast, or Big Guard, so he did cast it. Uh, Golem has been a very big help here. Um, the only thing that's really been hurting him, honestly, here is <clears throat> Bandaga. Um, so this, this has put him over 10,000 damage, so he's almost like a mini-boss. Oh my. I'm going to try to catch him in a second. We'll see if that works. He hits hard. Um, and he's very tanky. Like a crazy tanky. Um, he's got to be close to death. So let's see. This will put him over 12,000. And he's still alive. Can I catch him? Still too strong. Is he like a mini boss? Like, this guy is ridiculous. He, oh my. I, need, I don't know how much life he has, but this thing is crazy strong. And I don't really know why we're missing so much. I'm going to summon again. Unless he dies here, please die. I can't catch you. I got you too strong. Oh, I was supposed to summon. I'm going to lose characters because of that. This thing is crazy.
Well, you get to watch me beat him. This is probably going to be... I don't want this to be the whole video, though, man. I feel like I'm robbing you guys. Oh, my. 20 AB... Wow. Okay, so... We're done with that whole... Wow, that was a lot. So, we're going to go ahead and do some switching here. So... Okay, I'm going to keep him as a samurai. Uh, I'm not going to keep... No, you, Lena was... What, what did I have Lena as? I had Lena as... I'm going to put her as a Mystic Knight. Because she now has the two-handed. Which helps a lot, okay? Alright... Um, I'm going to keep Kral as black and as a white mage. Where are we on the white mage? Um, uh, we're almost there. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and camp right here. Oh, boy. Whew, that, that was a fight. Um, uh, let me see. I, I just want to see how much life they have, like, for real. Sting Ray. Um, yeah, that has 30,000 HP. I was not prepared for that. That's my fault, but whoa, that was like a boss. <laughs> like, straight up, that was a boss. Okay, so we got one more place to go. Um, we can actually fly there. We're going back to Pirate's Cove, um, which was... Doo -doo -doo. All right, so I'm going to have a lot to cut out. I do apologize. This uh, not finding location has been a problem for this video, but I will survive. So this is where we're going. I was looking for a different entrance. I don't really know why. So we're going to come in here. Um... We actually got to get to it, which we'll probably get into a fight, but nothing here is really dangerous to us. I'm glad I got into a weak fight. Okay, so uh, that was two Stropers, which are really, really weak. Okay, can you quit with the... Ex Why can you still not equip Excalibur? I do not understand. I'm getting frustrated because it says you can use it in everything I see, but every time I go to use it... It won't let me. And I don't really know why. And it's slightly... It's slightly... Um, I don't know why I could, I could do that, I guess. And that'll work. Okay, so we're going to take off Thornlet and put Diamond Helm on. And we're going to put Gauntlets for the Cursed Ring. And we should be good from this point. Yeah, I'll look into that. I'm not really sure what the heck is going on with that. There is a reason to come here. It's a pretty good one. I have two more Stropers. All right, that's good stuff I just saw there. All right, here we go. Sildra, you're, you're alive. Kind of. Ferris, what are you talking about? Ferris, do you see something? Don't you? Sildra's right there. Sildra, your Sildra's your name? Oh, you're such a good girl. Crow, you can see her? Sildra's spirit says she wants to help Ferris. Eh? Such a kind soul. It's going to eat you. Charlie, I love you, but let me do my thing. As soon as I'm down here, we'll be, we'll go up there. I got a little bit more to do, okay? Receive the summoned monster Sildra. She now is a summon. 
Um, she's actually pretty awesome. She does deal. She deals wind damage. Um, if you equip a weapon that boosts wind damage, it hurts a lot and takes less MP than Bahamut. Um, it only takes a minute of your time. So we're done with that. Um, I'm not done. I'm gonna do. I'm gonna get us at least a little bit into the next area because I feel like. I'm cheating you a video here, um, but I am a bit frustrated with this game. I'm gonna be honest with you, uh, but we'll we'll. Um, do I have the ability to leave? I do, but I don't feel like changing because every time I change, so everything in this has been two strokers. Just a heads up, it's still bad. This is almost a waste of time fighting. That was two stropers. I'll meet you on the outside. All right, so this next part sounds pretty simple to find. We just got to get to it. So let me see. I'm looking at the map. Um, we're going to a village that doesn't actually show up as a village. We want to follow this string. Okay, so we're going to start here. Nope. I don't think it's this one. Uh, let me make sure. Okay. I forgot that I actually wanted her. Oh, no. We're going to go and finish her leveling up her ability. Okay. That was two of those things floating on the moons. Mikhail's, I think they're called. Okay. So let's try this one. So in one of these fours is something important. Um, we'll get into a fight, but it actually won't lead to a fight. All right. Okay, so this is called Phantom Village, and, the, and my guide is called Mirage Village. Okay, um... Uh, so this is the best shopping place in the game. Um, I don't think we need to heal. Eh, we could use a little healing, but I'm not really worried about it. Alright, um, let's explore the town. We're going to explore the town, and then we're going to go and stop. So, uh, enter the secret entrance in the back of the pub. You have decent stuff, nothing great. Same with you, all right. Um, hmm. Okay, so we gotta find the pub. There's apparently a nice little secret in there. We're gonna do it all, all right, let's see. There's the pub. Um, slip in, uh, enter the secret entrance in the back of the pub. Okay, so wait, what? No, I just needed a Billy. Who has it? <sighs> okay, so there's a secret entrance. I'm not seeing it as of yet, but let's see. Ah, found it. Okay, so let me go to do... This is annoying. I'm going to end up selling the Thornlet and the Cursed Ring because I'm tired of equipping them. Okay, so once we're back here... Um... Okay, um, enter the... Uh... Slip in the back of the counter and examine the fourth barrel. I think we went too far. That's not the fourth. Um, that's the fifth. But the uh, thief knife. Okay, so that's kind of cool. Is it any good? That is the question. So who is using a knife? Uh, it's a little no it's better um and sometimes you still while attacking that's cool i don't the dancing dagger has that sometimes really hits hard but we're gonna try it for a little while we'll see if i like it okay so uh 
Okay, so uh, now go through the door on your left and head outside. Go around into the little shack first. Use the healing pot. Wait, what? Go around the staircase. Go around the staircase. Uh, go around to the other staircase. What? This is so crazy. Down through the door on the left, head outside, go through the track, killing pot, go downstairs, go around to the other staircase to find a secret shop in the back of the weapon shop. Um, uh, swimming here. Oh uh, yeah, she buy. Uh, she sells some good stuff. All right, we're not buying any, but that's good to know. Okay, now enter the door. Ooh, flame tongue, ice brand, Gaia hammer, morning star, rune bow, Kiku Yutomochi, partisan. Okay, so we're not done yet. Um. Now enter the door. Is it this door? Um. Okay. Head left through the secret pass to find a way back to the outside, but don't use it just yet. At least to the black chocobo that we won't be needing. So I go left through another secret passage to find the final piano in the game. We should be an expert pianoist, unless I missed one. Which I really, 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 really hope I did not. You have mastered the piano. All others quake in fear at your superhuman keyboard manipulation skills. And that's all you get. <laughs> okay, um... So it's a giant side quest that has no purpose. So, um, enter the armor shop. So, is this where we're going? No. Alright, um, enter the armor shop. How do we get there? Okay. So we're going to backtrack all the way back. Alright. Here, come around. Just curious, do you guys got anything I don't have? Uh, well, there's only one of you, so. Mini Toad. They're not very expensive. Oh. We are. Okay, so we got all three of these now. That's cool. Um. We're gonna actually skip this one. Where's the armor? The armor shop. I don't say the armor shop. I see. There's the sword shop. Are you armor? You are armor. Get out of my way. There's a lot of secrets in here, I see. Okay. Okay, I might be able to buy everything. Let's find out. Okay, so two crystal shields. I don't want 11. Okay. One crystal helm. Two circlets. One crystal armor. Okay, I'm going to buy you a white robe since you use white magic. Okay. So let's equip this. We got to do it single-handedly. So let's see how much better is. Oh, we can do two weapons. That would. That's cool. But we're not going to do that. Um, magic defense goes down, but I, I feel like that might be worth it. All right. Do we got anything better here? We do not. Crystal armor. We have it. Okay. Gauntlet. Okay. 
So, flame shield, we're gonna go ahead and give you. Oh, we can give you two weapons too. That would make you lethal. That's almost unfair. I might eventually do that. I don't know yet. Crystal helm, crystal armor, gauntlets. We're good. Okay. Um, circlet. Okay, we already gave you a black robe. All right, so you're gonna get a circlet as well and a white robe. All right, so that's good stuff. Um, okay, we have something else here. Wait. Um, if you examine the crate, you break open the counter. Oh, well, that's weird. Okay, what do you got? I'll tell you about rings. Flame rings absorb fire and protect against frost, but are weak against water. Coral rings absorb water and protect against flame, but are weak against lightning. Angel rings protect against aging and zombification. While I'm at it, I'll tell you about the ultimate pre accessory, which I accidentally sold the ribbon. It prevents most status ailments. Um. And she sells them. They are expensive as hell. That's probably one of the best in the game. So we will eventually need this when we come back to fight the super bosses. Um, okay. So we got one more thing to do and then I'm going to go ahead and cut this video and go wake up my wife. Okay, so it says there's two secret. Uh, the non-hidden shop holds quick, but if you go outside, okay, so we go here. Non-hidden shop holds quick. I don't know what it means by hold, qu holds quick. And through the northwest corner. All right. All right, arise. That's awesome to spell. Death, Osmos, quick, vanish. Awesome, so. Um, you definitely want to rise and dispel. So at this point, this is kind of where we're going to go and cut it. Um, so I'll see you guys next time. So adios, amigos.